Hey guys, it's Dan. So I'm just off to collect the little one from school, which is really cool. One of the benefits of working for yourself is that you get to go do the important stuff like picking the little kids up from school, which is really nice. So, uh, but I was just having a chat with somebody on the phone uh, who's quite distressed, actually, and they were distressed as a business owner, the gym owner, basically. And they are, let's just put it all over the place. Let's put it like that, shall we? They go in every day, feels like a prison, totally get it, been there myself, and there's certain bits that are missing from the business, and he doesn't know how to fill them in, you know, like we do because we've seen it, we've coached people and we've helped them through it and we've helped them implement it, but for this business owner, it's like he doesn't know what he doesn't know, he doesn't know what he should know, he does know stuff that other people have told him that he should know, but that's not helped, so it's the stuff that he doesn't know that's not helping him, right, so what does he do about that, what can you do about that, well, you can ask for help, first of all. That's, that would be a good start. And then, second of all, you need to listen to the help. Third of all, you might want to implement that help and actually get them to come and work on your business with you and bring partners into the business. And when you do that in a business, you end up getting a lot more resource for no money. I'll give you an example. So, um, we are talking to a business owner today and we are telling them about how the marketing is all over the place and they kind of wake up one morning and go, I know what, I'll drop leaflets. And dropping leaflets isn't a bad thing, but it is if you can't think of anything better to do. And you just wake up and it's not part of a plan. You know, leaflets is, is great, but what part of your marketing plan is that exactly? And they don't know, because they haven't got a marketing plan. It's just all up in the air. We just wake up and hope that it's going to work. So one of the things that we do is we look at what's going to be the marketing plan that's going to generate phone calls or leads. That's really important. Most business owners, it's too expensive. They don't know what to do, they don't know who to use, but we've got a tried and tested system that generates phone calls. So we implement that. There might be some small upfront costs on that because it costs us to do that, we want them good. But they're not huge, I mean, they're, you know, it's 500 quid a month. Um, and you get in return a whole bunch of marketing for that. But then, on top of that, you're getting all the marketing advice, all the talk on sales funnels, all the systems and processes for how to pick up the phone, how to speak to someone, how to um, convert that person into a sale, what the KPIs need to be on those, how many phone calls you're getting each month, where do those phone calls go, how many can you close out of how many of those, and knowing all of that allows us to drive better marketing. And that's just one aspect of it that you get included free of charge. The second part of this is management accounts. When I ran my lettings agency, we had a guy came in and sat with us uh, every two weeks, once every two weeks, and he'd go through all our numbers. And don't get me wrong, we had numbers on the bank, so we, we could look at bank statements, but that's not a true reflection on what's going on in your business. We even had KPIs on the wall, how many sales we get, how much for gross profit or gross margin was per sale, etc. But that still isn't a direct representation of actually how the business is doing. How the business is doing is when they reconcile the monthly in and the monthly out, that gives you a much better idea. Even that, by the way, isn't a full um, demonstration of what is actually going on. Because it could be that the big invoice that you have to pay out, that's not come in yet, and it's, you know, it's delayed in the post or whatever. Not that we do post anymore, but you know what I mean, it could be delayed. So it, so that's to be taken into account. But it gives you a tighter grip on all of your expenses. And if you don't know what those expenses are, how can you plan six months down the line? How can you plan 18 months down the line? How can you plan 36 months down the line? So with the marketing, you also get sales forecasting. Because wouldn't it be nice to know just how much money you're gonna earn in 18 months time? And at best, it's a guess. But it's a qualified guess, it's a professional guess, it's a guess based on actual numbers, not complete enough to, you know, put your finger in the air and see which way the wind is blowing. But if you don't know all this stuff, how the heck do you go and find it out whilst at the same time you've got a brush stuck up your ass, you're doing all the filing, you're doing all the sales, you're in the middle of something, the phone rings and you have to stop doing it and it's the wrong number and you're like, oh, and it takes you 15 minutes to get back into the flow, studies have shown, you can't do it. So you've got to have this external help, and that's where we come in. 
So if you want help in your business, if you like this business owner that I spoke to today, and you know, he's just overwhelmed with all the things that he needs to do, he's on this treadmill, 70 hour, literally 70 hour a week treadmill, going round and round and round. When he's done a 12 hour day at the gym, he's then got to do another five hours doing his paperwork, sorting his marketing out, doing all this, recruiting people, it just doesn't work. So we're here for you. If you need help, just come and drop me a message, and uh, let's get on the phone, let's chat about your business. Good to speak to you. All right, I hope that's useful for you in some way. Even if you don't pick up the phone and phone me, why not? But um, hopefully you're getting value out of the video anyway, and it gives you some insights into what you can do. But if you do want help, come and have a chat. Cost you nothing. Um, come and have a chat, see if we can help you, see if we can grow your business into something really valuable. All right, we'll speak to you soon. Take care.